All right, it was worth the drive. I was kind of worried there for a second. Oregon uh, two days ago. I'm in yeah, Kansas, California right now. Um, that, there's like a free campground that I found on iOverlander. It's uh, in between Doyle and Herlong, I believe. Uh, the main objective for today is to go check out Pyramid Lake. I had gone there before with Bobby you know, like two years ago, but we kind of just like drove through, got a couple shots, wasn't anything too crazy. Uh, the guy that gave me the mistletoes when I was giving out the burgers, he told me about a hot springs there, but I, uh, I've been looking into it. And it's been closed since the 80s, and he was telling me that you gotta go uh, ask for permission and stuff, and. I don't know if I want to do all that. There's tons of hot springs in Nevada, and there's actually one right up the road a little bit from Pyramid Lake that's like right off the road. So I'm thinking about trying that one out and uh, just going from there. It's good and windy. One thing I forgot about the desert was the winter winds. So I think it's about an hour away. So let's go check her out. All right, I've been driving for maybe like 10 minutes. I didn't expect it to be uh, a dirt road the whole way there. It's like 30 miles of this, I think, which is fine. I may uh, deflate the tires a little bit. It's freaking... Uh, pretty dang bumpy things are shaking around in here so yep just uh, just right over there is the Nevada border it's like a back way to Nevada I guess so all right let me get them tires going and boulders are pretty cool out there It's uh, 26 degrees and windy as all hell. Ooh, all right, let's keep on moving.
first turn off. Nothing? Drive up a little bit further and then uh, turn around. Looks like we might have to just kind of walk around a little bit. Might find some uh, interesting stuff out here. warm at all. I mean it's warm but it's not uh, super hot. Some oranges so they don't look like they're uh, too old. Ooh, man it is cold and windy. I don't 
know. Might have to freaking jump in. Let's walk around a little bit. Whew. I'm gonna have to just whew, jump right in. Whew. Oh goodness! All right, let's uh, let's get in. It's a little bit warmer than uh, than in here. Pretty nice. You see the fishies? There's actually fish, little fish in here. super refreshing definitely warmed up let's uh let's walk around here for a little bit see if we find anything come on jade she wants those little fish Like this is where more of the water's going. Maybe, or this might just be a separate, separate thing. Now get out of there. Walk down here a little bit and loop around back to the van. There's another pool there. That one looks pretty murky though, nasty. barren out here Bunch of owls. Woo. Oh man, what the heck? 
Mike is uh, in there. No, Jade. Leave him alone. guys let's uh keep on moving we were there for about an hour or so and feel rejuvenated and refreshed and hungry so i see dirt up ahead i wonder if we'll uh, be passing somebody but uh we'll see you over at pyramid lake So I tried to get some drone shots here. I, uh, I'm kind of getting into Pyramid Lake here, but it's saying that there's too much magnetic energy around here. So it's kind of weird. So maybe if I get closer to it, I don't know, maybe it'll get better. I'll show you guys though what I'm looking at. I was trying to get some drone shots of that out there. I believe that's the lake, but it looks like it's drying up. But, uh, this road's so freaking bumpy, I can't wait to get on the regular road. I'm over the bumpy road. I just want a regular road again. Man, look how dry dry it up it is like uh, let me, uh, I'm almost certain that all them pointy ones were underwater when we came by here like two years ago all that tan and this brown it's all dried up like, I'm pretty sure that thing uh, that thing there was like in the middle of the lake now it's just another year or so it'll just it'll be a one of them man this road is so bad please give me a paved road soon holla freaking lulia I fueled up in the Sparks and uh, got a couple pieces of pizza at 7-Eleven and it's only 1 o'clock. I feel like we've been at it all day, so I'm going to lay down for like an hour and just take a little snooze. I need to rest my head at 50 miles of freaking uh, 
I think mean, it wasn't 50, yeah, it's probably like 40. Freaking bumpy road just like rattled my brain, so. Take a little snoozy here. We'll see you in a second or an hour. <laughs> So it's been a few hours, uh, I kind of just like, I took the hour and a half and then I made a, about an hour and a half jump to where I thought I was, thought I was going, but, you know, good old, uh, combination of Google Maps and iOverlander sent me on a freaking, uh, 30 mile detour, the total, like, wrong way for some reason, I hate when it does that, so, anywho, uh, I guess I'm gonna go to Hawthorne. I didn't really want to go that far, but uh, I know they have a good rest area there, and I'm starving, so it's about 55 minutes away. So we'll get on uh, driving, I guess. Uh, it just got too late and it's too windy and cold and for uh, what I wanted to do outside so we'll save that for the next video I've been holding on to this spam for it seems like a year now so figure uh, let's make some like spam and egg fried rice with some uh, fresh garlic and avocado got the soy sauce salt and pepper olive oil that's frozen I mean that literally but it's like uh, a paste <laughs> and the old pulp beer so I got water on this burner yesterday so I'll start the rice to take two seconds and then blah, 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 do it all in the pan there in there all right let's get the choppy choppy going How many spam fans do we have out there? It's one of the things that's uh, it's definitely not you know a go-to favorite, but it's good on a on an occasion. All right, this thing's nice and smoky.
You know me, I gotta have an avocado on just about everything. Yes, I've never never had it on a pizza. I'm sure the right kind of pizza would be uh, appropriate for an avocado. Dinner time, I've been waiting for this. How's yours, Jade? Mm. Peppers and uh, Serrano's give it a little kick there. That's like a Hawaiian, Hawaiian Asian fusion. Well, I felt like uh, we did a lot of driving today. I hope it wasn't uh, boring driving video but at least you got to see my booty and uh <laughs> you know, you're gonna do a bunch of other stuff but that's how this lifestyle goes sometimes sometimes you spend your day just driving around so I appreciate you guys watching though and we got a couple of donators uh Walter Steve Michelle Lisa Doors uh, they've donated the last week, so thank you guys. It's gonna go to the, uh, help those in need. Feed those in need, jeez. Feed those in need fund for December. And then we also have Marjorie and James as a new Patreon, so thank you guys and, uh, cheers to everybody else and we'll, uh, we'll see you on the next adventure. Adios. I'm going to leave you hanging on the Walter Lake there. You'll have to see it in the next video. Adios.